India News 24 hour. During his visit to the southern states, Prime Minister Modi visited coastal Kanyakumari and Tiruvanantapuram where he will meet officials and public representatives as well as the cyclone victims, including the fishermen and farmers' delegations. Parts of Kerala, Tamil Nadu and Lakshadweep were severely affected by the cyclone late last month and early this month. The Prime Minister has constantly been monitoring the situation arising out of the natural calamity in the southern parts of the country. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has chaired a high-level meeting at Kavarati in Lakshadweep to review the situation arising due to Cyclone Aki which left a trail of destruction in the Union territory. PM Modi, who reached the island this morning, was received by top officials of the Lakshadweep administration and public representatives, including Lakshadweep MP Mohammed Faisal. Earlier today, youngsters of Lakshadweep extended a warm welcome to the Prime Minister. Parts of Kerala, Tamil Nadu and Lakshadweep were severely affected by the cyclone late last month and early this month. PM Modi has constantly been monitoring the situation arising out of the natural calamity in the southern parts of the country. The central government has already released the second installment from the State Disaster Relief Fund for Kerala and Tamil Nadu to supplement the efforts of these states in dealing with the situation. Governments of Kerala and Tamil Nadu have been given 153 crore rupees and 561 crore rupees respectively. Prime Minister Narendra Modi visited Lakshadweep, Tamil Nadu and Kerala today to review the situation arising in the aftermath of Cyclone Aki. During the visit, the Prime Minister was given an update about the status of the relief operations at Kavarati, Kanyakumari and Tiruvanantapuram. He met officials and public representatives and cyclone victims, including fishermen, and a farmer's delegation.